like subscribe and leave a comment see your review of wwe smackdown the week commencing the 8th of july 2024 so trish, Str trish uh, stratton comes out Macy gloats over her Money in the Bank win. Uh, congratulations to her. She is now the youngest Money in the Bank winner as well. Um, as soon as she said that, basically Bailey comes out, wants to give her some advice. So listen, I've been there, been Money in the Bank, slow your roll. But then she's like, I'm going to cash in on any champion I want, whether it's SmackDown, Raw or NXT. As she says that, Nia Jax comes out and goes to Bailey, you need to worry about SummerSlam because I'm coming for you. Um, but then Bailey questions if, let's say for instance, Nia Jax beats Bailey at um, SummerSlam, will Tiffany Stratton cash in on her? Then that that resulted in an attack, and Mia Chin comes out to help. So then it was Mia Chin versus Nia Jax in a really good match. Go and watch it. But in the end, uh, Mia Chin Mia Chin got beaten down. Nia Jax got the victory, and then. Uh, Tiffany helps and they beat down Bailey and then Tiffany looks like she's gonna cash in but Nia Jax stops her then we have Solo Sequoia basically saying the new bloodline is going to be more aggressive and everybody is going to acknowledge him so let's see what happens then we have Andrade and Carmelo so Andrade is having an uh, interview and then basically Carmelo intervenes <laughs> and then they have a back and forth so they're going to be having a match then we have Apollo Crews and Corbin Baron Corbin versus Phantasma in a really good match go and watch it but in the end due to some interference from Santos Phantasma get the victory then we have Randy Orton telling Cody Rhodes well Kevin Owens is out at the moment so uh, all all um shout out to kevin owens hope his family's all right is he's out so randy orton said he has his back for some reason against obviously the bloodline but for some reason i feel like randy orton's gonna turn and code it at some point he's a he's a viper then we have l a night yeah um comes out with a contract given to him by nick oldis signed by nick oldis signed by l a night to face um logan paul at SummerSlam, but he just needs logan paul signature that's going to be quite hard then we have at davenport versus naomi in a really good match go and watch it uh one of blair davenport's first matches but in the end naomi gets the victory over here then davenport is really nice to naomi in the back said so, our oh, best woman won but then she obviously attacks naomi afterwards then we have a town down under versus diy for the tag team championships rematch really good match go and watch you haven't seen it but in the end a town down a town down lose and diy the how their music goes i do like diy's music as well then we have jacob fatu basically saying to every basically after the match was over or something in my eye after uh, the match was over jacob fatu takes out everything walking he basically cleanses the whole ring for the tribal chief to come out solo basically comes out and he says he wants everybody to acknowledge him even down to roman reigns as he said that cody rose comes out cody rose like let's cut let's cut this me and you summer slam for the title as that was about to happen, Cody Rhodes gets jumped by, obviously, the bloodline. Randy Orton comes out to help, and he gets taken out, too.